Well, I had some people ask me some questions about my windmill question. Now, this is what the top of this is made of. It, uh, it swivels on the top here. And it has this tail flap right there. That needs to have a spring put back on it. I already know that. And there really isn't any space in between the blades here. I was asked the question by my friend Muddy what the space in between the blades and the motor is. So this is the setup. You can see this is all welded right onto the alternator, uh, the cooling fins for the alternator. So that really doesn't leave a lot of space in between there. It doesn't have to have this same setup on the top. I can always change it, put some different bearings in it and make something else. I'm sure it wouldn't be too hard to change the end up there if I wanted to put something else on. 